Well, thank you, uh, and thanks all of you for being here. Uh, think about it. Uh, our student athletes, I think, are, have gotten the message. If you come to UCF, you're going to play for championships. And, uh, you know, think about it. We've, uh, we've won three conference championships in the past five seasons. Uh, this is a great place for competitors, for winners. The UCF Knights will do something no one else in college football can play. Undefeated. Peach Bowl champions. How does that feel? I mean, it's great. I mean, you can't argue 13-0. I mean, I guess you can go ahead and cancel the playoff now. So we're really excited about uh, the next leader of our football program who, uh, and uh, I think gives us great perspective for the next chapter. With that, it's my honor to introduce your new head football coach, Josh Heupel. Thank you for the, uh, the reception. It, uh, this is a, uh, an honor uh, to be here and to be uh, UCF's coach. It's a fulfillment of a, a lifelong dream. It's really a fulfillment of a dream of being able to be the head football coach at a university where you have a chance to compete for championships and play on the biggest stages year in and year out. And there's things that every coach across America could see. This is the largest university in a great state. It's in the fastest growing city in America and it's on the most fertile recruiting territory in the entire country. And they are about going out and creating the future, not just letting the future happen to them, but about creating the future here at UCF. can celebrate his debut as a head football coach. The best part of my job is getting to work with you guys every single day, all right? We're one and oh, it's just the start. My name is Notorious, infamous, wanted man, dangerous. I'm an army, I'm a legion, I'm a ghost in, I'm a heathen. I'm the lightning, I'm the thunder, I'm the brain. Tark is gonna go all the way, fourth and one, touchdown. UCF will extend the nation's longest win streak to 22. They'll be 9 or 0 this season. It has been a week that UCF could only dream of. They remain unbeaten, and once again, the champions of the American Athletic Conference. Fire, fury. Oh, what a clock that set the arrow! It's a gutted touchdown, UCF! Legend. Today, as we get set for the 2019 Bad Boy Morris Gas Bowl, the UCF Knights take on the thundering herd of Marshall. Ricky it to the end zone. Picked up. That's going to be dropped, I think, to the end zone. Champs, baby. Legend. Knights are victorious. They finish the season at 10 and 3. Uh, real quick, hey, we talked about leaving a legacy, right? Your legacy is winning. It's doing it the right way. It's competing your heart out. All right, and it's being really consistent, and it's loving your brother, man. All right, and leading into 2020, young guys, it's our challenge to grow upon it and to take it to a whole nother level. Everybody got me? Yes, sir. All right, anything's possible if a group of guys come together, fight for one another every minute of every day. All right, we'll put our mind to whatever we want to all right, if we're willing to put in the work. Everybody got me? Yes, sir. All right. Florida is now under a stay-at-home order. Reporting more than 12,000 cases yesterday. It's the fifth straight day. Florida racks up another brutal benchmark. We're not going to have a solution to this. The virus is impacting sports teams and leagues around the world. The college football season really may be hanging in the balance. His medical expert said, you can't play. Should there be college football this fall? 
question, but just can you kind of explain how things are different this year in terms of camp, in terms of practice? Can you just kind of talk about some of the changes you guys have, have done for this camp? Yeah, it truly is the new normal. Uh, nothing is is uh, status quo of, of what it was a year ago. Uh, focus on, on today, go 1-0 and today, and, and uh, we'll move forward with tomorrow when we get it. If you haven't been paying attention, this offseason's been one for the ages and it hasn't necessarily been good. I think, you know, in a normal year and having to create your own energy, this year, uh, as much as any other year, you're going to need to do that inside of your own stadium. It will look and, and sound different than, than anything that you've uh, prepared for. And I think the ability of our players to, uh, to stay the course, control what they can control, um, you know, have fun and enjoy today um, because that's you know really the only thing that's definitely promised to you. Great job, man. Be great in every area of your life because you can. That's the challenge right here during your four-year career. other in all three phases of the game. The most important thing we do is play harder than our opponent. Energy. All year long, you got to create it yourself. Whether that's in our home stadium with reduced capacity or you go on the road. There may not be anybody in the stands. We got to create our own energy.